Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry for this uh, weird intro. I am actually going to meet up with my friends right now. We are heading to the Glossier pop-up in Atlanta. Super excited. I hit up Glossier actually last year pretty much harassing them like yo when is this pop-up coming to Atlanta and yeah they finally said we're on our way so today is February 19th and this is the first day um, that they opened I know they had like a launch party yesterday my friend went to that and she took pictures and it looks really cool in there so I'm excited to see what all they got I definitely need to rebuy a few things so Hopefully they have like the same kind of bundle deals at the pop-up as they do online. But I doubt it though, now that I'm thinking about it. So I'm excited to take you guys along with me for this pop-up shop because they always do something like cool and different each and every pop-up shop that they have. So yeah, hopefully they allow cameras and stuff in there. I mean, you know, you definitely can take pictures with your phone, but I don't know if they allow cameras. We'll see. I'm excited. So the next time you see me, it will be in the pop-up shop, which is now. Cute, cute. So if anybody wants to come to the Glossier Atlanta location, these are the times and the dates. Well, just the times. Okay, so my thought so far on the pop-up shop is that there could have definitely been more. Hey, Audrey! Also known as Adranita on Instagram, by the way. Skincare enthusiast. Um, yeah, but the pop-up shop was... It was okay. I mean, I don't know, Glossier. I just expected so much for Atlanta. Like Miami's pop-up was so cool. So I don't, I don't know. If you guys go to the Atlanta pop-up shop, let me know what you think. I just feel like just could have been a little better, you know? I did get some stuff though, so I'm excited. I'll show you all that stuff later or probably another day. I'm like out of breath. <sighs> Why am I so out of shape? <clears throat> the real questions here uh yeah anyways we are currently trying to find something to eat me and my friends so uh yeah we're gonna do that and i'll see you guys later all right so i am back at home and this is the bag that all my stuff came in they put everything in these little like individual bags 
Um, I guess depending on the item and like size of the items. So I went ahead and picked up the travel size milky jelly cleanser and I pick up the smaller size because I really don't use this like as my everyday cleanser. I only use this as like a double cleanse whenever I'm removing makeup. But if you guys see any of my like skincare videos, you already know that. So yeah, definitely needed to re-up on this. And I also went ahead and repurchased the solution because I actually really, really like that stuff. I do feel like it has made a difference in my skin. And I ran out a long time ago, but it's this thing. So as you can see, this is the empty bottle here. But yeah, this stuff is amazing. Highly recommend if you were looking to get anything on Glossier. This is really, really good to have in your skincare collection. So every pop-up that Glossier does, apparently they do some sort of like special item. So I guess Georgia's special item was a t-shirt. So this long sleeve t-shirt, which is really cute. You can't really see it because it's like a crappy day, but this is like a really nice peach color. The quality is really good too. I'm like, okay, Glossier. So it has their G logo right here. It's like this felt material. So that's pretty cool. And then on the back, it's that felt type of material for like this logo here, but it's supposed to be like a band tour vibe. And pretty much it has like the dates of each of these products like launching, which I think is pretty cool. So when bomb.com launched and like the solution. So that's really cool. So yeah, that was pretty much everything. Um, my overall thoughts on the pop-up itself is it was a nice pop-up, obviously. You guys saw, like, definitely giving me all types of Glossier aesthetic. I just felt like for Atlanta, we could have had a little bit more. There's so much culture here in Atlanta, and I don't know, I just kind of feel like they dropped the ball a little bit for, um, you know, this pop-up, but... I won't complain too much because again, it was really nice. The experience was really cool. So that is my only complaint. I mean, there just could have been some culture blended into this pop-up, but hey, what you gonna do? Honestly, I didn't even expect to be going to the pop-up shop on the first day that it opened up to the public, but I'm so happy that I ended up going and it was very last minute for me to like vlog this, but I am glad that I did. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. I know this is super short, but that is all I got for you today. I do hope to have a new video for you guys up soon, but until then, I will catch you on the next one. Be sure to give me a big thumbs up if you enjoyed and check out my other videos while you're here. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Bye, guys.